Uh, Mark Cohan, the f- former commissioner of the Cane Football League, he did an outstanding job, by the way. I think I look at his tenure and what he did. Uh, he's always been a high performer, but never as good as when he joined us in studio about three, four years ago, I want to say. It was just when David Stern had gone on Jim Rome and they got into this thing about controversies, about you know, you know were drafts uh, fixed in order for certain teams to do better. And I heard it that day. It made the rounds because there was a real blasting back and forth between Jim Rome and David Stern. So I figured, well, with Mark Cohan coming in studio, would he have a similar conversation with the fake Jim Rome? And by the way, it was done live. There was some scripting because we wanted to follow it. We wanted to do a good parody. So there is only one take. This is the commissioner of a professional league in North America who is literally now a part of a radio play. It was brilliant. It was so much fun. And when we uh, come back on the other side, we'll play a little more Mark Cohan at what he's doing now with uh, the Georgian Bay Spirit Company. But first, Mark Cohan, then commissioner of the CFL with the fake Jim Rome. Hey, T.O., what up? What up? It is Thursday, and a great Thursday, and I will tell you why. The commissioner of the Canadian Football League has joined me here in studio, and it's certainly great to have you, Commissioner. Thanks for coming in. Good to be here. (laughs) But I do have to ask this question. With the trade, with Ricky Ray going from Edmonton to Toronto, it's produced the usual round of speculation that maybe that trade was fixed. I know you appreciate the good conspiracy theories, just like the next guy. Did you fix that trade? Oh. The fake Jim Rohn. I have two answers for that one. I'll give you an easy one. No, and I'll give you another statement. Shame on you for asking that. You know, I understand why you would say that to me. I also wanted to preface it by saying it respectfully. I think it's my job to ask. I think people wonder. No, it's ridiculous, but that's okay. I know you think it's ridiculous, but I don't think the question is ridiculous because I know people think that. I'm not saying that I do, but it's my job to ask that. Have you, just tell me, have you stopped cheating on your taxes? I don't think that's fair. Well, why is that? I don't think that's fair. I'll tell you why. Because I think there are, and I know you read emails, and I'm sure you follow things virally on Twitter. People really do think it, whether it's fair or not. You don't think the question's fair to ask if your fans think it. Uh, People think it is because it's people like you that kind of just ask a lot of silly questions. Okay, let's get on to, okay. Okay, Okay. I think two things which responds to this. Number one, I don't think so. I do think that I am not covering myself. I don't think so by asking that question. You know, I I won't hold it against you, but, you know, I've been in more contentious situations. So, you know, we should probably talk about the CFL soon. I don't know. I, uh, I, I, I think it's right up there. Well, it's good copy, so you know, and, and you know, sometimes it's cheap thrills, but you know, the fake Jim. No, I, I did on. not. I did not do that for a cheap thrill. Well, it's kind of. It sounds like it. So come on. No, not at all. Maybe. See, that's where you and I, and that's our point of disconnect, because I'm going to ask a direct question. People do wonder, but that was not a cheap thrill. I did not get a thrill out of that. Yeah, it's a cheap trick. No, flopping is a cheap trick. <laughs> Listen, you've been uh, successful making a career out of it, so I, you know, I'm here to talk about the CFL. So making a career out of what, though, Commissioner? See, I take great offense to that. Making a career out of what? Cheap thrills? <laughs> you know, what offense are you taking? You just you're taking offense. Look, I am now. And if you're saying I made a career out of cheap thrills, well... <sighs> you know, fake Jim Rohn, you're just pounding, and I love it. So, let's go on. Okay, well, look, I'm uh, running out of time, so... I think we got to call this a day. Uh, you know, listen, i got to go. we got some important things to talk about, like the start of the season. All right, Commissioner. Have a nice day. Best friends. Yep.